Okay guys, so we are out here. We are going to rent a bike and later cycle along this uh, dinosaur mound. So apparently you can rent the bike over here. Okay, as you can see, there's a lot of different bikes. Okay, this is the larger one, is it? I scared I cannot go up here. <laughs> Okay. Let me go first, huh?
Alright, so as we are making our way back to the end or the starting of the Jurassic Mile, I want to share my thoughts on the place. First of all, I really enjoyed the whole bike ride. It wasn't too long nor was it too short. It was just right in my opinion. I was actually hoping to see more dinosaur sculpture or installations, but I'm also aware that some of the installations were mainly in the night, such as the one at the entrance which has lights and the dinosaurs along the way. If you are thinking of visiting, I will highly recommend you to come on weekdays as you can see there aren't many people around. I bet the weekends will be much more crowded, at least double the size. As for the pricing of the bike rental, it costs about $8 for the one that I'm riding and $7 for the kids one. For now, you do get one hour free if you plan to rent it, but you do really just need less than an hour to complete the journey to and from the bike rental itself. I'll show you guys some maps at the end of the video, so please do stick to the end. For now, let's head on back to return the bikes. As mentioned, if you are interested to get to the Jurassic Mile, here is a map to the place. There aren't any other maps online, but basically what you want to do is to park at the multi-storey car park at T2 which is basically Terminal 2. And walk towards Hub and Spoke, which is basically where the bike shop Go Cycling is located. There are a total of 11 dinosaur installations as you can see from the site map. So do try to spot all of them and let me know if you manage to in the comments below. Hi guys, so I apologize for the late sign off. I was actually sending my nephew and niece as you can see them in the video. If you like this kind of videos, give me a thumbs up and subscribe down below. If not, I'll see you guys in the next video.